So the question is going to be, graph each pair of parametric equations with the given restriction on t, and then express y as a function of x. So if we have the parametric equations, x equals 3t and y equals t plus 2, we want to graph this, I would do a t-chart. Well, wait, what's the restriction? Oh, let's say the restriction is t is greater than or equal to 0. Okay. Thanks. Oh, jeez. So we do a t-chart. So it would be 0, 1, 2, 3, 4? 0, 1, 2, 3? Um, we could stop at 2. Actually, we only need three points. He's right. You want to start at if my domain restriction, or sorry, if my time restriction is t is greater than or equal to zero. That's what I want to start to, with if here. If two is greater than zero, then you start with just then one. Then you start with one. Actually, I'd go ahead and start with zero anyway, so I could identify my, my domain restriction. Oh, so plug they, in zero. You use it as a point, though. Right. So plug in zero, and I get three times zero is zero. Zero plus two is two. two. Plug in 1, and I get 3, and 3. Plug in 2, and I get 6, and 4. Now I graph it. So 0, 2, over 3, up 3, and over 6, up 4. I don't take my line this direction because my time restriction is t is greater than or equal to 0. What's my domain restriction? X is greater than or equal to what? Zero, because X starts at zero. All right, so now we need an equation. What's my y-intercept? So y equals mx plus two. My slope, rise over run, a rise of one, and a run of three. So my slope is one third. And I've answered all my questions. My domain restriction is greater than or equal to zero. Oh. Y is a function of x. Hold on. 